Doug, as you know, that format will be key to watch tonight. So this debate is here in Atlanta because both parties consider a win in Georgia really a top priority for them. This is now considered a purple state after eking out a win for Joe Biden back in 2020. Atlanta News first anchor Carly Barnett joins me live here in Midtown. And both candidates know tonight every person watching could make the difference in that outcome in November. Carly. Well, Blair, that's absolutely right. Both candidates are trying to win over the growing Latino community right here in Georgia. And political experts say that could be a huge difference come November. I have some numbers for you here. In this state, more than 400,000 Latinos are registered to vote, and they make up 5% of voters here. So that may seem like a small percentage, but think about it this way. In 2020, when President Biden won the state by less than 12,000 votes. So we spoke to a voter here in Atlanta who said he voted for Biden in 2020, but he's not sure yet how he's going to vote this time around. Whoever got the better agenda, for the next four years, uh, that's what I'm voting for. These next four years, you got to do something about the people that are here already, not the ones that are coming in. Now new polls show so far Trump with a slight lead over Biden here in Georgia. Live in Midtown Atlanta, Carly Barnett, Atlanta News First.